got such a great cast. Yes. I would love to know, what's your funniest or most memorable moment from filming? There were so many in this cast. We had such a great time together. We had a karaoke party and, you know, all kinds of stuff. But uh, there was a time where we were shooting up in the mountains in Italy on the on these, uh, in these snowy mountains. And we were waiting for the light to be right. And Woody got a little restless and started throwing snowballs at people. And him and Chewie and I got in, like, a big snowball fight that was a lot of fun. Well, Chewie is in costume. Yes, that's right. <laughs> that's right. I think, I think at some point... Chewie tackled me into the snow, and then we shot it as a scene. So maybe we'll see it on the DVD? I think so. I'm gonna just rewind back to the karaoke party. Yes, yeah, sure. <laughs> What's your karaoke song? I don't really have one. Phoebe made me sing an Elton John song, and I'm not great at karaoke, although Donald's pretty good. Everybody else is pretty great. You'd imagine Donald's gonna be awesome, That's right? right. Yeah, has I to mean, be. it's like a free concert, pretty much. <laughs> and how did Elton John go down? I don't know if it went down that well, to be honest. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm glad that's not recorded in any way. The funny stuff kind of happened around Woody Harrelson. He's a pretty funny guy. Uh, there was a lot of singing on set. There was a lot of impromptu dancing on set. There was um, a lot of Wookiee hugs, a lot of Wookiee love. A lot of Wookiee love. And then there was one moment, there was this particular set that had like the floor like an ice rink, and everybody fell. <laughs> Everybody fell. Sometimes mid-shot, you'd see a camera burst and just like, boom, boom. So that was quite funny, where it was just like the most lethal set. And you can kind of see it in the movie when we're all kind of stood there going, don't fall over. What scene is that? It's on Dryden's yacht. It was just lethal. There was so much like slipping up that happened. It was quite funny. That sounds like terrible planning. I know, but it looked great. It looked brilliant. <laughs> How were you with bloopers? Were there any moments that made you crack up laughing? Yeah, there was a, th okay, so there's, I used to get called Exposition Jones in the movie, because sometimes I'm saying a lot of exposition, I'm saying a lot of like stuff, you know, about stuff. Like this is stuff and stuff happens to stuff and this is the logical thing that happens when this stuff meets that stuff. Um, <laughs> that is terrible. Uh, and so that happened a bunch and you'd forget, and every once in a while someone else would have this, uh, Donald has a particular thing where he's, we're, we're, we're flying around and he's got to describe some stuff and he just couldn't, he just could it was just one, <laughs> just couldn't, it was just one word he just couldn't get done. And so even now when watching the movie, I'm like, <laughs> no, he did it, oh, he did it, they got the one where he did it. <laughs> so I'm half expecting it to like, one of us to start cracking up. Do you remember what the word is that was hard to? Yeah, but I feel like it's a spoiler, so I'm not gonna say it. And then also there's definitely one shot where, where, where like, where all you can see is the back of mine and Woody's shoulders just going, like, having an absolute giggle. <laughs> so yeah. Woody deciding to eat prunes <laughs> no, through an entire that. That's scene. That's the funniest. Yeah, yeah it me was having a bad told him idea. not to. Because it, you know, those things go all day because you keep shooting other angles and everything. And she did tell me not to, and I did keep eating those damn prunes. <laughs> and you'll, you vowed never to eat a prune again. <laughs> oh yeah, because it was I ugly. I haven't touched a prune since. <laughs> it was hilarious. Sorry, but that is the truth. <laughs> That was the funnest, funnest day. <laughs> <laughs> what scene is that where that's happening? When Madam we first Ma properly talk to him. Yeah. And you Talked just noticed that um, this one is taking something black out of a jar, eating the whole way through. And it, it was the most memorable day on shooting for me. <laughs> Those are not stunt prints. It was a real, I told you so. I was like, my stomach is killing me. She's like, yeah, you just ate your own body weight of prunes. Of course your stomach's good. I've heard there was an epic snowball fight. Yeah. You were part of that as well. Yeah, yeah, there, it was epic. Lucky we were you weren't eating prunes that day, my we were... friend. That would have been <laughs> seriously ugly. Yeah, we were out there in the Dolomites. <laughs> And uh, going along this trail, you know, we were firing them at each other. It was really fun. And who would you say won that fight? I do remember uh, Yono s smacking me a good one right in the face. And he was fully uh, protected, and he too. he was protected because he's in he's his got those uh, big hands. chewy uh, outfit, so yeah. Woody's just always funny. He's so naughty he's as so, well. Yeah, he's just always funny. Like, <laughs> there was a point... <laughs> There was one part where we were like, um, we're supposed to be running in and out of the cockpit, like running in and being saying something and running out. And I would run out, and then it would be time for me to run back in, and he'd just hold me. So I couldn't, and I'd be like, oh, God, like that, and he's like, just la he's like, I like just enjoy laughing. And I'm like, stop it, and I'm running and I have to do, be serious. I, I just thought it was really funny. There was a point where um, the Wookiee Jonas you know, uh, and um, Phoebe, uh, just dancing together 
for about five minutes or something like that. Middle of the night. Middle of the night. Everyone was so tired, no one reacted. They just stood around us in a circle, like staring at us like that. But just gyrating with each other, just dancing. And then we're on just filming it like that, like. <laughs> it was really uh, pretty funny. To music? <laughs> or just it was silent. It was weird. dead silent. It just felt like it was like because only on a, immediate little speakers. It was like <laughs> yeah. just like <laughs> it was uh, yeah. But any time, any time, Chewie was off camera and like bored and kicking around. So him like trying to open a can of coke in the corner, or him like trying to rootle through his bag to find something, or he's like looking for his phone. Or <laughs> That's it's always funny. Oh, it's funny. It never gets old. <laughs> but the funniest thing, it was kind of surreal, was one of the first big action scenes that I was directing. I, there, we had a lot of chaos going on. We had aliens. We had droids. We had, you know, a lot of Wookiees. You know, blasters. Uh, the Millennium Falcon was there. It was crazy. Did this whole complicated shot, and we were so excited to get this complicated shot done. And I said, great job. Great job, guys. And I got a fist bump and a body hug from Chewbacca. Uh, and you know now that's that's a, that's an experience that every movie maker should have, uh, but not many do get that opportunity. And I thought it was uh, surreal. I was beaming. I was beaming like a, like a kid, handling props and very fluidly. When you when you're when you're in that kind of action, there's a lot of slipping and falling, and there's a lot of fumbling of props and a lot of cursing that goes with it. And those make the best bloopers for me. <laughs> Who cursed the most? Paul Bettany can be pretty foul mouthed and very funny about it. He's our bad guy, Dryden Voss, and uh, he's got a lot of uh, badass moves, um, but when they don't work right, um, Bettany was very upset with himself.